For most of us, putting on shoes is just another part of our daily routine, but that isn't the case for everyone. Hi, I'm Sienna, and I'm a member of TSA, and I'm the vice president of an organization called Kids for Kicks. Did you know there are 300 million people around the world who can't afford shoes? Well, here's how we are going to change that. So, Kids for Kicks is a nonprofit shoe drive, and basically what we do is we collect shoes and repurpose them for those in need. The most fulfilling part of being a part of this organization is knowing that all of our work is going to help someone at the end of the day. When we do service, it helps us develop empathy. We're not born with empathy. It's something that has to be learned. When we give, it tends to want to make the next person give, and it just goes on and on and on and on. My Angela said, you can't go through life with your catcher's mitt on both hands. You have to be able to throw something back as well. Once we established our idea, we got right to work with our preparations. First things first, we designed flyers to hang up around school. Then, we filmed and edited a promotion video. And lastly, we built boxes to contain the shoes. There are many students in our middle school, so our goal is to drive in at least 100 pairs. After a solid four days of collecting shoes, we ended up passing our goal of 100 pairs and reaching 121. Once the drive ended, we collected all the pairs from the middle school, tied them up with rubber bands, and packed them in shipping boxes to send to our partners all around the world. Our main goal is not only to collect shoes, but also create awareness and teach our community why it's important to help those in need. We have taken the first step to help others keep walking. We hope to continue this journey one pair of shoes at a 